If you've ever broken your leg or twisted an ankle, you probably know how helpful crutches can be. But as News Channel 5's Olivia Michael explains, one local hospital is asking the public for a leg up as they deal with a supply chain shortage. In a world full of supply chain shortages, hospitals are not immune. We see about 1,500 patients each week, and so about 50 of those patients will require a prescription for crutches. In just a month, the Williamson Medical Center's Bone and Joint Institute could administer 200 sets of crutches, not including those that are given out in other parts of the hospital. And so it's a little difficult to care for a patient and send them home after an injury if we don't have the supplies to do so. Now some of those supplies are running short. Uh, there's actually a shortage of aluminum which most crutches are made of. That's why the Crutch It Forward campaign is leaning on the community for help. And the community was so helpful last year when we asked them for help with masks and PPE that we thought reaching out to the community and asking them to help us with this would make a lot of sense. All kinds of crutches are asked to be donated, as well as other walking aids made of aluminum, like canes and walkers. Those items that come in, they will be provided to the patients at no charge. So the donation really is paying it forward for others in the community who may have a need for crutches, walkers, or canes. In Franklin, Olivia Michael, News Channel 5. To find where you can donate, visit our website, newschannel5.com.